Hello and welcome to the HPIN Learning Hub. Today we're going to have a look at the importance of design and following the designs that we send out to you for your install. So when you get your pack and your information about the install you're going to complete, you will receive a schematic. The schematic is crucial that you follow this um, as per the actual drawing itself. It shows you the position and layout of all the components so that we know that we've got the components in the right order. So it's going to tell us that the ESBY valve needs to be before any sort of low loss. Um, it's also going to tell us if we've got a volumizer in our system, where we need to put that on the return close to the system outside. So following the schematic is really important. You will also get drawings on pipe runs and where we want you to run the pipe work. It's crucial that you follow these also because our design team has worked tirelessly to make sure that each design is spot on for flow rates, um, for distances, for um, the head heights, etc. etc. So where these pipes go and where they're drawn on the drawing is crucial to the design. Apart from pipe work, you will also receive some information on electrical uh, wiring. So you will receive an electrical wiring diagram. If you're an electrician or if you can give this to your electrician, it gives very clear information on which terminal goes to which part of which component. So it's almost like uh, joining dot to dots um, with numbers. You can't go wrong if you follow it perfectly. If you've got third party controls on your unit, you will also receive a little third party drawing. Um, this tells us where a contactor kit goes um, so we can switch a third party pump if we need to. It's also really important that you follow this because they can work on zero volt switching. And this means we switch the neutral. So if we're putting any live wires where they shouldn't be, we can quite easily damage the PCB in the outdoor unit. So make sure you follow your schematic Make sure you follow any pipe run diagrams that we send out to you and any information around that. Make sure you're an electrician or if you're an electrician that you follow the electrical diagrams that we send and any third party controls and pumps will also come as a wiring diagram for you to follow. Thanks for watching and if you're interested in more air source heat pump videos, give us a like and subscribe and check out our other videos. Thanks for watching.